that is when it's being done. So what are intent filters? Intent filters uh, are a mechanism to inform the Android system which implicit intents they would like to handle. So if uh, if my application wants to listen for phone ring, maybe I have to, or let's say my application would like to know uh, when the phone is booted completely, I have to uh, mention it in my intent filter. So activities, services and broadcast receivers can have more than intent filters. Obviously, as they may be interested to listen more than one intents. And this, these intent filters are set up in applications manifest file, which is called as Android manifest.xml as intent filter elements. So an intent filter has fields that parallel the action data and category fields of an intent object. So whenever an intent object is created, this data is fed in and the same data is mentioned in intent filter. If Android system compares and finds them to be same, it, it makes out that this component can handle this intent. And there are some, uh, we have talked about action, data and category. There are some special action and category like uh, special action is main and the special category is launcher. Whenever you have an activity in your application which needs to be launcher for your application. For example, um, you have an application with four activities A, B, C and D and you want whenever your application gets launched to activity B should be launched first. Then activity B may flow to other activities. So you got to have an intent filter which specifies for this activity action as main and category as launcher. Based on this Android system knows this is the first activity which has to be launched. Uh, this is the manifest file we talked about. 